Hi guys, it's Sebastian Bates here, the founder of the Warrior Academy and the host of the Warrior Academy podcast. Today, I wanted to share with you a short chapter from the book, Not a Victim. Not a Victim is a book I wrote in 2021 with the sole aim of helping parents mentor their children through the very, very difficult transition of bullying. Um, I also recorded it as an audio book. So if you'd like to have that book, then listen to this chapter, get a feel for what it's all about, and then have a look on Spotify or Audible for the audiobook, or even on Amazon for the physical book if you like a paper-based book. I really hope that it helps you prepare your child for the eventuality of going through bullying. Bullying is an inevitable but difficult transition that most of us go through in our lives. And as parents, I think it's really important we act proactively to prepare our children for the eventuality of having to go through it themselves. We can't always be there for our children, but we can give them the tools. We can empower them to face life's obstacles on their own. I hope you enjoy this chapter. Live, make way for magic. When you do what you've always done, things usually don't change. So there's no need for you to adapt. What makes you come alive is opening yourself up to new experiences and ideas. Even when you're doing something you've done before, it is important to be open. What is magical about the situation you are in? Or if it's a negative situation, how can you create something magical out of it? We both went through bullying, and from those experiences, we have created this book and audiobook, turning something that was painful and made us feel like nothing into something magical. Love. Add a bit of love to all you do. If you're going to do something, add a bit of love to it. Add love to the activity you're doing, to the conversation you're having. Have the self-confidence to believe that you are good enough to be loved, to do things you love and to love others. Keep falling in love with yourself, your activities, your environment, and the people around you. Before moving on to the not a victim process itself, we would like to share another story that illustrates many of the themes we have been discussing in this chapter. Jason Greystone is an investor who has developed educational businesses that teach people how to achieve financial independence. During his last year of high school, he experienced bullying. Bullying Breakthrough 4. Jason. It was mental bullying, never physical. I was badly threatened, which meant that I couldn't focus on my schoolwork and exams. Most of my last year in high school, I ate lunch in the toilet and left school before the bell rang. There were times when I didn't eat or sleep and spent my Sundays sweating at the prospect of going to school the next day. My friends were no help, as they preferred to be a part of the gang. My parents had regular meetings with the teachers, with other parents, and so on. But as the bullying wasn't physical, there was no evidence. That made it hard for the school to deal with, and this lack of action made it hard for me as I was branded with the image of being mad and or paranoid. I passed my exams, but got poor grades. The experience was so horrendous that when I left school, I completely deleted it from my mind. Today, I cannot remember one teacher's name and hardly any of my schoolmates. I really hope you enjoyed today's Warrior Academy podcast episode. We're gonna keep creating these episodes because I know that so many parents find them useful or get insights or get ideas about how to develop their child's character. But it all comes down to the three C's, confidence, conduct, and concentration. So if you want to get a deep insight into the levels of confidence your child has, the level of concentration they have, or the level of conduct they have, so that you can actually put a score next to it and then work towards increasing those scores like we do in the Warrior Academy, then I'd love to invite you to fill in the breakthrough area assessment. It takes about five minutes of your time and you will get a personalized PDF report on your child's three C's. To access the breakthrough area assessment and find out your child's three C's score, all you need to do is go to www.breakthrougharea.com.